Boxing Ego here. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon on the top of your screen to get notified when the latest new content drops. One. U.S. Olympian Shakur Stevens and another boxer were arrested after a brawl in South Beach. Stay tuned. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel for the latest and greatest in boxing. If you want to become part of the gang gang, notification gang, please hit the bell icon. Shout out to the Super Chat channel, donations of Venmo, donations, and the Patreon family. We are working. Now, a lot of people asking me about this situation on my various social media. Shout out to you guys if you follow me at Boxing Ego. And I have no additional information on this particular subject but Shakur Stevenson was reportedly arrested and I looked at the, the article and whatnot so I don't have any additional information beyond this so I don't really have much thoughts but the link is in the description so you can read it yourself and I'm gonna give my brief thoughts it's from slaterscoops.com exclusive rising boxing star Shakur Stevenson busted after a South Beach brawl it says former US Olympian medalist silver medalist and rising star went to jail after being accused of turning a south beach parking lot into a ring miami beach officers arrested shakur stevenson early sunday morning after the alleged uh saturday night fight social media posts show that the newark new jersey native was in miami celebrating his 21st birthday stevenson was seen in instagram posts before and after his arrest hanging out with hip-hop superstar drake who obviously just dropped an album scorpion I've seen those pictures on social media, too, and I liked them. Then it says, Officers say the incident started when Stevenson and another boxer, David Grayton, 31, approached their alleged victims in a parking garage at 230 20th Street and started making sexual innuendos towards the group, which included two women. Words led to fist flying. During the fight, one male victim was being pummeled. Quote, even while he was on the floor the exclusively obtained arrest report says so i guess they have the the police report of what was stated the other victims both females were also struck with closed handed fists by both boxers according to the arrest report fire rescue treated the alleged victims on scene they all had visible injuries police say the two boxers had already left the area but officers were alerted that they were staying at the shore club hotel about an hour later officers found stevenson and grayton at the hotel stevenson had a cut on his lip grayton had cuts on his knuckle police say there were witnesses to the fight and it was captured on surveillance video which is probably somebody's iphone or android both boxers are facing one count of misdemeanor battery stevenson's next scheduled bout is august 18th atlantic city right i think brian jennings is headlining that card um not a good look not a good situation i know for some reason people just attribute everything every time a young fighter does something they bring up broner like oh broner did this he's gonna be another broner Devin haney's dating black china is Broner. like broner don't have nothing to do with he has his own situations he didn't do this he didn't create this but it's it's crazy i seen the pictures he looked like he was at drake's album listening party in miami south beats shout out to the scorpion album i'm kind of getting into it and just listening to it it's cool i don't know i don't really have much to say it's a report i'm anxious to hear if shakur stevenson gets on the record he probably won't because he has a pending um misdemeanor battery case going so he probably won't be able to do any kind of videos or anything talking about it and um, i don't know i don't know what the situation i don't know if people were intoxicated i don't know if it's a miscommunication um i don't know about the girls getting hit so there's not really much known other than what's being reported drop your thoughts in the comment section and like i said for me he's a young talent and hopefully he goes if this is true hopefully he just goes down the right path because he has all the talent in the world i've interviewed him before i seen him he was just at the last time i seen him was at the errol spence ocampo fight right standing right next to him or whatever so hopefully he even though he's a celebrity he's from a rough area like newark new jersey hopefully if this is true or whatever he takes it as a learning lesson takes it as a slap on the wrist can beat his case and come to an understanding with the alleged victims or whatever and then move forth and this is not a recurring thing we'll have to wait and see what happens as more unfolds drop your thoughts in the comment section if you know what happens if you've seen the tape i haven't seen the tape but it says it was recorded on surveillance video so i don't know maybe the business has a surveillance security camera maybe this is going to be like some kind of amateur world star cell phone video not really sure but 
I'm sure it'll probably come out at some point. Make sure you smash the like button. Also subscribe to the channel. As always, hate, comment, and subscribe. Till next video is Ego signing off. So if you enjoyed this video and want more content like this on the channel, you can show your appreciation by going to the PayPal donate button or the YouTube support button. And you can donate any amount that you feel is equivalent to the value of this video. Much more to come. Thank you guys for your support. Boxing Ego, the future of boxing. Yeah.